There's cameras all over the city. They're tracking us no matter where we go. Nighttime will be easier. With more options. A daytime entrance into the Chrysal Resistance Headquarters is not advisable in the least. Never been attempted as far as I know. But the skies seem clear. No one's following us. I think we can make a little history today. This is a two-part maneuver. Done right, we should head perfectly into a blind spot. Everybody ready? Go! Now! Run! is they really are stupid. So long as we're hidden by this mist, no one will see us. Now, for the second part, the jump. Once we're underwater, hold your breath, swim after me. Stay submerged no matter what happens. There are Nazis all around. If you break the surface, they will kill us. Don't hesitate. Jump! I'm so sorry. There was no break in front of that hatch when I left. I've been in prison for the last three months. Oh, it's gosh dang stupid. Shouldn't have seen anything before I left that. Great job keeping us alive out there, Captain. It's good to be home. <sighs> Gently. Whoa! Stand down! This is Klaus. He's one of us. He was a Nazi before, but he's on our side now. Crazy, Johnny. How is this possible? We are in the very center of Berlin. You are hiding in the plain sight. It's the last place they would have got. Will they not hear us? Best to keep your voice down, Mia. Yeah? Fuck me. B.J. Blaskovich, I should have known only you would be dumb enough to do a daytime entry. Yeah. Glad to have you back, Bart. Caroline, you're alive. If you call shitting in a bag living, three pulverized vertebrae. You? Head trauma, four inches of cast iron shrapnel right in the conch. Still in there. Severed colon, septic shock, shattered pelvis. Memory loss, flashbacks, 14 years in a loony bin. Good to see you, William. So, what can you do? For your collection, Jay. Wow, so happy to, like, see you, man. What's it been, three months since I hauled you away? I thought you were dead, actually. You send people off to that prison, and they, like, don't come back, you know? It's a trip, and you brought some new cats with you, actual, like, reinforcements. It's cool, man. I am hearing interesting things out of London. I have a folder marked Project Whisper, but someone has borrowed it. Klaus, I believe it was. Can you find it and bring it to me, would you please, Captain? Now that you are here, I think we can do great things. Why don't you sit with me, Miss Anya? Listen in on these frequencies. Anything out of London, make a note of the time and write down as much as you can. Here is pen or paper. Can I do a typewriter? You know how to type. Yes. My parents thought I should learn. Ah, for you to take dictation, prescriptions and such. Um, not really. It was useful during my time at the University of London for my doctorate in archaeology. Then the blitz came and I had to go back home. I was only 16. Well, doctor, please. 
assist me in figuring out what these damn Nazis are up to. Max, ich suche schön die ganze Zeit nach dem Hammer. Hast du ihn gesehen? Max, 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 Max. You know, about before uh, going off on you like that, it's a force of habit. No worries, Johnny Cowboy. It's not the first time it happens. Yeah, perhaps you should consider removing them tattoos. I will, in time. I was, as you Americans say, all wet when I got them. And I'm sorry to say it was a very proud moment of my life. I want removing them to be an even prouder moment. No more Nazis, no more tattoos. So long as you don't get in the way of me killing Nazis, we'll see eye to eye. Caroline's looking for a document folder, Project Whisper. Oh, he is a human. Max doesn't speak English very well. But he does know Project Whisper. It's a risky business operation. He knows it'll cost us to pull it out. Max doesn't like violence. He doesn't want to see anyone get hurt. Alles in Ordnung, mein Sohn. Wir werden für dich kämpfen. Caroline said you borrowed the folder. Do you have it here? I did take it two days ago. But I put it back. Go to the ground floor. The folder should be in the drawer in a desk in her room. Where I left it. Make a looky loo in Caroline's room. The folder should be inside. Hey, it's not in there. Already looked. Anyway, I forgot to tell you. Try and not speak about Project Whisper when Max is around. He heard us discussing the plans for it, and it really upsets him. Caroline, I've been wondering, would it be possible for you to give me some firearms training? You think you can handle killing a man, Anya? I think so. Takes a very special mindset to kill a man, Anya. Even if he is a Nazi. I'm not sure you What's have to do it. Maybe you can give me a name. God knows we can always use more shoes. No, oh, oh, it's so good to be home, Captain.
Much obliged, Captain Blaskovich. You ready for an assignment? Friends and comrades, this is it. Project Whisper. It's been in development for years. A helicopter aircraft. The Nazis have found a way to make it virtually silent in flight or undetectable by means of radar. Anya has decrypted the Nazi chatter out of London and located the only three prototypes in existence at the London Nautica research facilities there. With Captain Blaskovich on the team, we are finally strong enough to strike at the operations. The days of scurrying like rats are over. With these machines in our possession, we can go anywhere, hit anything. We will rebuild the Kreisau Circle, arm ourselves to the hilt. We will rise up and take down death head for good. They think the war is over, that we are weak, beaten, don't have the guts to oppose them. And as always, they are wrong. I've got a 14 hour drive. I've got a sinus infection. I haven't had a full night's sleep in eight months. So let's go, people. Because I'm not doing this again. Thank you for doing this, Brian. Stop. I just want to get this over with. 